Please take your seat. Thank you. Actually, Doctor Prashant has sent me here. I know everything. Tell me, how was the day, Abi? Yeah, I'm okay. Okay, I'm okay. But I don't know what's really happening. What's going on? If I really want to something, or if I want something, that's it. It's just happening before I do act. I feel like uh, somebody is really observing me, or uh, some force mm -hmm. is reading my mind behind. And I am, and I am totally scared. Okay, Abi, it's all karma. Karma? What? I didn't understand. Who is doing all this stuff? Can you please explain? Okay. Tell me what happened to you. Dr. Prashant, I need your help, man. Oh, shit. How can he call me? Okay. Hi, Abhimanyu. Your appointment for today evening, 6 p.m. is blocked. Press 1 to confirm. Thanks for the confirmation. Your appointment has been confirmed. How did I get the call from Prashant's hospital? How does he know that I am not feeling well now? Abhi, it's getting late for office. Yeah. Sakshi. There's no press shirt. How can I go to office? What happened, Abhi? There's no press shirt. Uh, sorry. Actually... Uh, one moment. Sorry, madam. Yesterday I couldn't come. That's okay. Thank God you are here. I have a shirt. Can you give it to me in 10 minutes? Sure, ma'am. I'll give in 10 minutes. Okay. Pressman came for laundry. Let me get this done. Pressman has come. How does he know that I don't have a press shirt and how did he come now? Horrible car crash outside of town. Ever since the accident, when school is not in session, his determined young daughter attempts the long journey home. But sadly, his dutiful child never makes it that far. As the couple are about to leave, the Abhi, that on yeah. the way back do you remember? Today is Thursday. Yes, I do. Uh, one more thing. Our car is due for service today. I'll take the car. You get a cab. Okay. Back on the road, curiosity gets the best of the couple and they stop at the cemetery. 
What the heck, man? How do they know that I need a cab? <laughs> Sakshi, I'm leaving to office. for it's your time now give this luxurious watch to your beloved preeti today and express your love and no <laughs> hello food vendor sir Your fruit box is ready. What? Do you remember? Today is Thursday. Today is Thursday, sir, and it's already lunch time. Hello. <laughs> what happened, Abi? Why are you behaving like that? I don't know what's happening. I feel like somebody is observing me. If I want to do something, or if I want something, that's it. It's just happening. I don't know what's really going on. Oh, okay. Weird. Seems you are so tired and looking restless. Don't take much stress about this, Abi. Okay. Anyway, you have doctor appointment today evening, right? I will also accompany with you. Don't worry. Be brave and be strong. Okay? Thank you, Prem. No props, man. Don't take any tension. You can go. Hmm. <laughs> Abhimanyu thanks for the confirmation your appointment has been confirmed yesterday i couldn't come pressman has come how does he know that you get a cab preeti today and express your love today is thursday today is thursday sir shit Come in. Hey Abi, almost after two years. How are you doing? I'm okay. Come sit. Sir, I have a problem. I know about you, Abi. You have consumed too much of an alcohol, so you're here today. Yes, yes, but but how do you know, sir, that I had consumed alcohol okay. today? Okay. Please take these medicines for three days. Have a good sleep and. Have a little less alcohol, okay? Take a normal diet. You should be all right. But, but how do you know, sir? Like I have consumed? Yeah. Please visit her. She will tell you the rest of the course. But who is she? She is a Shreya psychiatrist. But, but, but why? Why psychiatrist? Why psychiatrist, doctor? Next. You can leave now. Now I understood. So you were already patient of Doctor Prashant and went to him two years back when you had five pics. So he has the historic data of yours in his database. That's how you got the call. 
How does he know that I had drinks last night? That too, more than 5 eggs? That's what Data does. He is an alcoholic specialist. And he has tied up with all the bars and pubs in the city to run his hospital business. It's all automated. You had 7 picks and bill was generated for those drinks under your name and that sent a trigger to the hospital which has your historic data with your limit as 3 picks already. Here, your data is transferred from pub to hospital to get business from you. It's all automated. That's it, you got an automatic call from the hospital. Oh my god. Now your pressman. I think he generally comes on Wednesday to pick up your clothes. He might have missed you come on Wednesday, that's why he came on Thursday. That's it. Hmm. Okay. Then you said you got a message from taxi providers, right? Yeah. They know that you are in need of a cab as they have your car service due details from the car service center. And they dropped a message to you expecting business from you. That's it. Same with your food provider. Nowadays, food provider knows your appetite very well than you or anyone, depending on the time and type of food orders you make. So you order fruits every Thursday, so they call you and confirm without any action from your side. Again historic data. Oh, wow. Okay, even money gets deducted from salary account automatically. Now it's convincing. How about the watch? I have one thing. Uh, it's little personal. I have a girlfriend and nobody knows about it. And we both went to shopping mall to purchase a watch for her two days ago. And the same watch has appeared in the afternoon when I opened my mail. How? Okay. Did anyone ask you to fill coupon or form while entering the mall? Yeah, I did. For a lucky dip. Praise his car. <laughs> they took your name, email ID and phone number. And also they made a note of your interest for the watch. That's how you got the mail. So... Everything was happened just because of data? That too, it's just because of the data what I provided? Exactly. Don't assume that hmm. the data provided by you to someone else remains with them alone. It travels across. That's how you get ads when you open browser depending okay. on sites, items you check and online orders. Okay. Your phone number, your email ID, your location, hmm. everything is tracked. Even some apps you download in your mobile tracks your every activity. Oh my god. So, do they know everything about me? Yeah. Nowadays, they also have programs in place to guesstimate your income depending on your spend and types of goods you purchase. That's how you get real estate, credit card, loan calls, even though you never provided them your contact details directly. Oh, can't we keep anything secret then? No. You cannot. It's all karma. You gave the data, it's got analyzed and returned. You can't escape. And nowadays, I found some vendors selling data on social networking sites too. See here. Oh, unbelievable. By the way, thank you very much for the information. But. How do you know all these details as a psychiatrist? Not just a psychiatrist, I'm a data scientist too. That's how even my business runs. Okay now? Ha, huh, feeling better now. But little confused though. Thank you very much for the information. And how about the consultation? Okay, you'll get a message and you can pay it online. Hmm, you can leave now. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much Rhea. <laughs>